So do you have any updates today, Farm Girl? Uh, not really any updates, but we do have something very important to talk about. Oh yeah, we do. Very important. Yeah. Do you, you want to go outside and do a quick walk and talk? Sure. And you guys want to go for a walk? All right. Does everybody want to go for a walk? <laughs> so cute. All right. Let's do that. Okay. Hello, everyone. It's Exo Man with the lovely farm girl. Hi, everyone. <laughs> and uh, we have the Banshee Moon Channel, the Exo Man Channel, and now Banshee Magazine. Show me your Banshee Mag. Show me your Banshee Magazine. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, we wanted to talk today. We wanted to do a, a public service announcement. Yes, something that's been brought to our attention recently. Mm -hmm. uh, something that's not talked about a lot. Yeah. Te testicular cancer. Testicular cancer. April is coming up. Yep. That's. And what is April? Testicular cancer cancer awareness month. Well, now come on. You're that supposed is to. A tongue tie. You're saying it, you're saying <laughs> it for me because it's difficult for me to te say testicular, <laughs> but you couldn't even say cancer. Okay. <laughs> So I got it out. You know what I mean. April is Testicular Cancer Awareness Month. Now, this is something that is is just not talked about, as Farm Girl said, and that yeah. needs to change. And we want to help change that. And while I was researching this, we were asked to do a PSA on it. Yeah. And while I was researching this, I found that the, there is a an Aussie Rules Football Club, the Wolverines in uh, in the UK. And shout out to those guys, an amazing group of young men, I think a dozen of them, sat on a stage <laughs> with a couple of doctors explaining as they went, and these young men just robed and did self-exams for testicular cancer. Now, <clears throat> this, I, I, I want to say at the get-go here, I would appreciate no, no joking. This is a no joking matter, yeah. okay, so let's not... And, crack jokes about this. Yeah. We really are trying to want to wear, raise awareness mm -hmm. about and, it. And there are many uh, YouTube videos that actually show you how to do this. Yeah. Well, that one does. People, the, with the well, yeah, 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 yeah. But people don't generally watch that kind of thing. Yeah. But it's really important. It's just like yeah. breast self-exam every month. Yeah. And I don't know There's, why either of these things needs to be uncomfortable in this day and age for us to talk about stuff like this is just common sense yeah. it should be practical knowledge for every young man to know how to examine himself and for, for the parents to get their children checked and to teach them and to spread this awareness mm -hmm. so because it, it kills little kids babies yeah um, now see affects... i might have thought i might have thought that this was something that affected Older men, men who are producing a lot of testosterone, right. but that is not so. It, it occurs most often in men and boys between the ages of 15 and 35. Yeah. And if it is not treated, it will kill. Yeah. And uh, imagine, can, imagine that it has killed little boys and babies. Spread your whole body. Yeah. yeah. So um, <clears throat> there, there. You know, I have to say that I have been through my life woefully ignorant, uh, raising yeah. a boy of, of our own. We had a boy and a girl. Mm -hmm. And I, you know, remember bringing my son to the doctor and, you know, they checked him down there, but I don't know how thoroughly. And we've talked about it recently. And he said, oh yeah, dad, I do that routinely. Go Smart figure. Smart kid. Smarter than me. <laughs> so he's perhaps more aware it's because there's... just not something that's top of mind awareness if yeah. you just don't think about it. And now, when I looked on Charity Navigator, I found that uh, breast cancer awareness foundations, one or the other, or some of them, are in, have in the hundreds of millions of dollars in assets. Mm -hmm. Whereas when I looked well, yeah. at the testicular awareness foundations, they were the most I could find was hundreds of thousands of dollars Amazing. in assets. Amazing. Well, and <clears throat> we personally have done fundraisers for breast cancer awareness. We've done it for Red Cross. There's so many things that we've tried yeah. to raise money for and we, and do we the never run, thought about. Run for the Tatas and stuff like yeah. that. But we haven't thought about this. And I've known of people who've had testicular cancer. It's, yes. it's, it's all yeah. too common. Yeah. <clears throat> so let's start talking about it. And we will put a couple of links uh, below to foundations in case you want to learn more or give mm -hmm. money to these organizations that are, <clears throat> as I say, woefully underfunded. And uh, that's about, uh, about it. Yeah. Research so. it. It's, it's a problem. 
And it's, and, uh, it's, it's very easy to examine yourself. And it's very easy if you catch it when it's just starting. It's nine, you there's 95% uh, cure. Rate. Yeah. Uh, successful treatment if it's found that's amazing early enough yep and again a big shout out to the to the young men on the in the uh, Wolverines football oh, yeah. club there for doing that nice uh, work <laughs> nice work guys really <clears throat> anything else you want to say about that let's just make it not awkward <laughs> yeah well thank you for watching everyone and please again be sure to check the links below in this video and all videos that we publish and be sure to check out our web pages bansheemoon.com and banshee magazine there's the new t-shirt <laughs> all right everybody thank you very much for day. watching have a great day have a great april